So hello, this is Africa. Welcome back to This is Africa. And now let me take you to Dar es Salaam in Tanzania and just show you how it is uh, during the morning. And this is a video that I'm doing. And this is after I did travel from Arusha heading all the way to Dar es Salaam. That is about a 12 hour journey. I left Arusha at around 6 p.m. and arrived in Dar es Salaam between 5 a.m. in the morning and 6 a.m. in the morning. So I just want to show you how things are during that time. Uh, for those of you who may not know Dar es Salaam, Dar es Salaam is the largest city and also financial hub of Tanzania. In fact, we can say it is the financial capital of Tanzania and it is also the former capital city of Tanzania. Dar es Salaam is also the capital of Dar es Salaam region. This is a city that has a population of about 6 million and also don't forget that Dar es Salaam is one of the fastest growing cities in the world. So when I arrived at that time and I'm talking about uh, between 5 a.m. to 6 a.m. in the morning, that was the time when a lot of people were preparing to go for work. So during that time, that is the time you are able to see how people do get ready to go to work. The traffic is not that much, but there is a traffic, a bit of traffic, although it is not that hectic. Traffic in Dar es Salaam is something that you can be able to manage. Uh, that is if you are aware of your routes, because there are some routes that may have less traffic than the others. So Dar es Salaam is the city that has seen a lot of projects, like the one that I did show you of Tanzania BRT system. That is a Dar es Salaam BRT system. When it comes to transport system, Dar es Salaam is very well organized. It is also organized in a manner the way people do conduct themselves, the way they behave, and also we can see that they have tried to keep the city clean. Other projects that are there, you can see the roads are almost new. Traffic lights have been installed. The people do observe the traffic lights. The street lights are there. Another thing that uh, you will be able to see there is uh, these flyovers that are there in the city of Dar es Salaam. And we cannot ignore the biggest project that is there, and that is the Tanzania SGR, which is going to be fully electric. And of course, its main hub is obviously going to be in Dar es Salaam. And this is because, you know, Dar es Salaam is a port city. And by the way, the Tanzania BRT, which I have told you, uh, its main port is Dar es Salaam, is too close to the port of Dar es Salaam, which is one of the biggest in East Africa. Another thing you would witness when we go there is the Tazanite Bridge, which is going to be the longest bridge in East Africa, which is going to be very useful uh, for the people of Tanzania. So this is how the vibe is in Tanzania. I, ha I do have a lot of videos of Dar es Salaam, which I'll be releasing them so that uh, you can be able to see how different cities do work or how they are. Or you can even just have a slight idea of how the city is, which is very important. So guys, so thank you so much for your continued support. Thank you. Make sure to subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. So by the way, there are a lot of uh, ships. I do believe they're heading to dock at uh, the port of Dar es Salaam. I don't think that uh, we can be able to walk to the other side, guys, because from what I can see here is that uh, the bridge is here. But at least we'll be able to see it from uh, this side I think I might go down just to get uh, the full picture of this bridge so that uh, you can be able to understand how big this bridge is but it's very big it's uh, very big but uh, and it will be open very soon So that, that is the bridge. So let me try to go to the other side so that uh, we can see how it is. So here it is from uh, this side. Uh, it will be opened very soon. It is not yet open. So I was thinking maybe I'll be able to go to the other side, but at the moment I can go, so I think I will try to go to 
I will take a very long walk to this beach. This is a palm beach here in Dar es Salaam so that I can uh, take from uh, the other angle. So guys, this is the Samora Avenue. And now I'm in uh, Abba Road. So a lot of people are heading to work and some are just opening their businesses. I'm just coming from the Garden Avenue and this road that you see here is called Mount Ohio Street. I'm just confused whether I'm going to hear this way. I think I wow. Let me just say this way because I can see a very really loud building over there. So I just uh, had to cross over to the other side to see if we can uh, have a better view from uh, this side. 